when it comes to living out a vision, it's important to identify what are the key components and then what are the specific strategy to move forward and take the next steps. When it comes to daily grace for our church, uh, one part of that is serving. And when it comes to serving, you know, how does that break down? Well, it's really knowing what are your spiritual gifts. The Bible talks about spiritual gifts. Do you know what yours are? And then what are your natural gifts and abilities that God has given you? And a lot of people, when it comes to natural abilities, uh, let's say it's just fixing a car. They think, well, I could never use that in church. Or they're gifted in terms of finances. I could never use those skills and knowledge in church. But in fact, the opposite is true. There's so many opportunities in a church context to use our natural gifts. And then, of course, our spiritual gifts. It could be like teaching and administration, or it could be uh, intercession and prayer, uh, leadership. So lots of opportunities. As we think about serving, it's again, as we abide with Jesus, it's not a checklist, but as we're close to Jesus, there's a great joy because he's made you to serve and he's given you gifts as you use those gifts and also invest your time, your resources. Think about the finances he's given to you. The word tithe jumps out in the Bible. Tithe means a tenth off the top for the Lord. And so that builds up other people. When it comes to serving, we take the focus off of ourselves. Instead, look around. So it's not me, 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 but it's we. And what could I bring, not to show up and be a consumer, but what could I bring to bless other people and build them up? So uh, when you think about all the different roles in our church, and uh, there's a wide range, participation is a key. Our prayer is that 80% of the people on an average weekend attendance would find a regular monthly role to serve because of that value of serving. And again, life is so fulfilling. Have you ever noticed when you're kind of down, one of those things that can really lift you up and change your outlook in life is when you find people to serve and places to serve. We believe that is foundational in a healthy relationship with God. So think through how you're serving and where God's leading you these days. Say yes to the Lord and it'll be a great joy.